Hey guys, welcome back to Avorian, the spaceship building, galaxy exploring, resource trading, gun pew pewing, game of excellence and wonder. My name is Twitchy and last time, last time we took down the MAD scientist research group. I think they're a research group, more of an organization than a specific person. But we took them down and at the very, very last moment of taking them down, we received this message from the Brotherhood. Well, actually this was from Bifkiwaks, our ad adventurer friend. I heard about a group of people who, are, who also want to cross the barrier. They are looking for Zotan artifacts as well. They have posted on bulletin boards of stations. Maybe you could find them and we can all work together to overcome the barrier. And I'm like, yeah, that's a great idea. When I read that, they gave me a mission. The Brotherhood! You know what? I'm gonna uh, stick this up in the corner over here. But you may have noticed, you may have noticed that down here the diplomat is destroyed. He took the, the first and hardest brunt of the fight against the scientist last time. So I'm just gonna quickly pop in the word repair up here and jump my way over to this station. Whilst I'm waiting for my crew to come down and meet me, it turns out I've got a much larger hyperspace jump than them. I think we're going to come into here and do the modify the entire ship. Uh, you know what? I, I've been going around with uh, fairly low level materials for a while. Let's bump that up. Boom. All right. Oh, no. How much am I short? Oh, man, I haven't even got a third. That's why one of the things that I want to do as well as following this line of adventure over here is to upgrade my mining vessel. I feel like we can stick a hanger on it and a bigger cargo cargo bay, maybe some more weapons. I don't know. We, we could definitely do it with upgrading it quite a bit. Oh, great. The ladies here as well. Well, I haven't gone around and just checked out all the bulletin boards. There doesn't appear to be anything for a group called the Brotherhood. Let's try talking. Uh, you're a military guy, aren't you? Well, let's have a look. You there, over you. Hey, uh, scan, where is your home set? No, nothing, nothing to talk about. One thing we're going to do while we're in such a well service sector here is have a look at my upgrades. Yeah, let's have a look. Can we sort this out? I don't really want to look at my turrets. Uh, I, one of the missions that we have is to try and put four, five purple upgrades in here. Maybe, maybe the carrots, but unfortunately the Zotan ones don't count. Now the only way we, as lowly humans, can get, go around, go, well, are we humans, are we AI, who knows, can, can make this is by putting four, uh, five, sorry, of the orange ones into there and getting a purple out. Then we need to do that five times. Uh, it, it seems a little unsurmountable if you ask me, but we're gonna go through and we're just gonna level up all the items that we've got here. Maybe not the petty ones, because they're, they're actually technically a little bit rarer than the common ones. And I really wish we could shift click here. I've literally got to cl click and drag every single one of them up and into the box. Oh, but there we go. It took five of the commons and gave us an uncommon. I can put less than five in and it'll give you a slightly less chance of getting the item that you want. I uh, I feel like it's a bit of a waste. So we're just going to go ahead and do the 100% trades every time. Quantum hyperspace upgrade. Let's try this one as well. Go. All right. Beautiful, beautiful. What else? I saw I saw another five. So there we go. A seven, a turret control system. I mean, do we try the four? Let's, do, let, let's try the four. See if it pays off for us. So far, every time I've tried anything less than a full stack, we have not got anything back. Hey, we actually got it this time. First time this game. Shield booster, trading system. W why not guns? Lots of guns. Another camp. Oh, okay. This is interesting. If you take one off the top line, I, I can't do it. If I take one off the top line there, it doesn't research, even though I put those there. We got four. Place at least three items for research. Uh -huh, it's slot dependent. Is that interesting? I find it quirky. I find, I, I find most things that are quirky are worth talking about. Though, I don't know, I can definitely see why people would find this entire process quite boring. It's just click and dragging a whole lot of stuff to get the upgrade. So lower down through the commonalities, this was a little bit of a grind, but now that we're up at the higher levels, it's uh, quite hard to find anything that stacks above, well, in this case, one. Wow. Okay, and before we leave in search of this mission, let's have a quick ask round and see if anyone's got anything. It was 25 rockets. What about the repair dock? Nope. <laughs> well, I guess I'll just take an easy delivery mission for now then. <laughs> one gate jump over. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, and it's the station right in front of us. I like the idea of delivering a bunch of neon to a repair dock so they can fix people's signs on the side of their ship. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. Let's check their bulletin board. New opportunities. All right, that's not the one we're looking for, though. This is the, the, this is the black market skills, I believe. Uh, the black market bulletin, I believe. Not the one we're looking for. 
Hmm, there's only one station here with not black market bulletins. Let's check the trading post. Resource. Ah, no, that's not what we want either. Whilst we do go around looking for the mission that we want, I'm going to go ahead and take the, the, the time here to upgrade my mining vessel. We've been complaining about it, so I think it's time to do so. The first thing I do, extend that engine out. I want some bulk on the back to be working with, uh, and that gives me enough room to start putting down some plates down, and these plates can be, uh, like, assemblies and production areas, and, of course, the crew comp compartments will also need upgrading at some point. First thing I put down, of course, is to put the hangers down. I, I really just need that space for the fighters. If I don't do that, then there is no purpose to anything. And whilst doing so, I noticed that mm, there's a little bit of a, a funny edge going on with the corner, so I put down some glow blocks there to make it look just a little bit nicer. I, I feel like the mining vessel has been completely underglowed. It could definitely do with a whole heap of new lighting materials and stuff like that. But we come into some fun with a triangles here. As you can see on this side, I've been trying to, uh, to construct a set of, I'm going to call them petals, like I have up on the front, but this time on the diagonal. This means that I'm trying to do three different compound curves together. It is very difficult, and indeed I think I've gone about it the, in the wrong way. Whilst I'm trying to put the back edge onto this uh, set of curves that I've been building, I kind of started out building a diagonal line going out and then edging that forwards, and then thinking that I could just kind of put the uh, put the triangles on the back, put the corners pieces on the back to try and make that work. But I very quickly realised that was that just wasn't going to be the way that it was going to work. So I started playing around with some more shapes, and indeed the way that I had originally done the grandest entrances, I'm going to call them um, like wings, is the way that I go ahead and do the ones over here. I start off by building myself a big shape on the front, and then I, I copy that out and swap it round, mirror it to stick it on the bottom, giving us this weird triangular piece to come through. I was having all sorts of cut and paste issues though. As you can see, I'm placing down on one side and it goes very much onto three of the edges, but unfortunately that fourth corner just got left out, meaning that I had to go back and manually place down that edge. It means there's a lot of camera swinging around and me trying to figure out which type of twisted corner block wants to go in what spot. And actually, actually, eventually I ended up going, you know what, we're just going to try this all over again. Place that down. Mostly it worked out well, but we had this one little corner spot here that just didn't want to paste. That's fine. I went around and put some hollow graphic blocks down. I then copy and pasted that piece that we had here, but I noticed that if I carried on doing it the same way that I had, like copy and pasted the, the same segment over and over again, we'd end up with it just being a, a, a diagonal line going off and not coming round to the front, which is what I want. So what I did is I took off some of the pieces from the front, stretched them forwards a little bit, and then uh, was able to stretch the entire copy and pasted piece uh, over and over again, giving us a more and more elongated forwards curve, thus giving us this weird, uh, I'm gonna call it a tentacly type appearance to it. I, I really liked it. I particularly actually quite like the way the holographic uh, triangles worked with that. I, I think we're gonna go well. They do look a little thin. I will very much admit this here. They look like they could do with bulking up a little bit. The next thing I always do was put some triangles, some edges, some corners around my hangers, because as you can see, they were just kind of like bulkily standing out there. So I, I came through, I put down some triangles. One of the things that I'm noticing about these triangles is if you keep them within uh, one width, like a, a whole unit's width, like 0.75 and below is enough, you can kind of just like jam them through with each other. It's only if you go above one that they're like, ah, no, we can't put these on top of each other here. Last thing I want to say really, really quickly is that if you can use the highlight option inside the build menu, there is a way of looking at only one type of block. If you're having trouble coloring any piece of block because you've got other blocks behind it, just go ahead and use that. You can only select the blocks you want and then you can color them up. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, uh, yeah, I was going around doing some missions with the diplomat and up in front of me right here. Hey, how you doing? Bulletin board looking for Zotan artifacts. In times like this where the Zotan threat is looming at all times, we're trying to protect you. Dangerous artifacts of the Zotan have been found all over the galaxy, causing great harm to everyone near them. Should you find any of these artifacts, you may bring them to us. We will take care of them and destroy them to eradicate the Zotan threat and to make the galaxy a better place. Even if, you're ally uh, even if your life may be at risk, what is your life compared to the safety of trillions? You can find one of our outposts at minus 36, minus 174. We're, uh, we will pay a reward of 1 billion. Is that bit worth? Yeah, it's 100 million credits for each delivered artifact. The Brotherhood. Okay, I've got to accept that. I've got to accept that. All right, beautiful. 
Beautiful. Mission updated. I mean, it doesn't doesn't look... Oh, I mean, we found the bulletin. Now we need to go find them. I, I think we can go find them. Let's have a look at that. Does it tell us down here? It doesn't tell us down there. Uh, if we press this... Is there a clickable over here? I, I'm not... I'm not... I'm not seeing a clickable over here. Uh, we've also got this artifact delivery mission just popped up. Some people who call themselves the Brotherhood have posted bulletins and are looking for Zotan artifacts. They seem to be paying a high reward for people who bring them artifacts. I mean, that, that's pretty cool. That's almost exactly what we're doing. These guys, down here. All right, we're, we're, uh, let's send the rest of the fleet there first. The more I sit and think about it, the more I'm like, there's an inconsistency in this story here. The, uh, collecting the artifacts and destroying them does not sound like wanting to get across the barrier. What, what's up with that? Hey, what is up with that? All right, was everybody able to follow me? Oh, hey, look, we got a room full of stuff. Um, in particular, okay, here's the craft. Here's the lady. I bet the grandest entrance couldn't make it. Too far for old entry, boy. There's a lot of wreckage around here, I've got to say. A lot, a lot of wreckage. Okay, well, the object detector is beeping something at me over there. Let's get going. It's a scanner beacon. Has the grandest entrance turned up yet? He's on his way. I did. There we go. He's, he's made a jump. Uh, he's going to be... Uh, protecting the craft when he turns up. So we'll we'll see what happens with that. Hmm. Hmm. How close do I want to be? Like, these guys are supposed to be my friends, right? Let's press F. Let's talk to them. Hey, scanners online. Activate. Scanning. Success. Calling the collector. Please be patient. Extraction will begin shortly. I don't... I never liked the word extraction. Okay, looking around. Ah, tank them. I can't believe it. Our bulletin actually worked. Uh... I, uh, who are you? You're looking at the first people in centuries who will fly into Zotan territory. Oh, mate, yeah, it sounds like a plan. I'm also going to follow you, right? New encyclopedia unlocked the four. Oh, dear, I've heard of them. Uh, once we've collected the artifacts, we'll be able to open the gateway and recover the Zotan treasures and take... No one says anything about treasures, what? But you won't have to worry about that. All that's important is that you brought us one of the artifacts. You will now give it to us. Um, what about my reward? Oh man, look at this one. Do you really think we would get a... Yeah, yeah I did. We lied! We don't want any witnesses or competition. Boys and girls, let's blow this maggot to space star. Are we ready, guys? Are we ready? Go! I'm just I'm just gonna pull, pull out of here. Okay, I kind of wish I was in the... Um, in the, 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 the craft, but I suppose we'll make do with this. Are we making any dents in them at all? I don't know. I feel I, I feel like they're not actually making any dents on me either yet, but we're yet to actually take full brunt of damage from four uh, four people targeting us. This guy seems to be going down pretty well. Um, I'm okay with that. The diplomat holding up quite well. Relations with the Brotherhood has worsened by quite a bit. I'm kind of okay with that. Uh, also noticing that the lady, or is that the craft, really getting in close. If we could just take down this one guy first, that would be pretty good. It would be like a quarter of the way through. Okay, I'm now pressing R and seeing which one. I don't see the red circle, uh, red uh, triangle. That's the word I'm looking for. I thought it was over here. Anyway, four kilometers. I think this should actually be okay. After our intensive fights with the... Oh, did someone die? Did someone die? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, with our intensive fights with the scientists, this shouldn't work out too difficult. In fact, this seems to be working quite well. Can't help noticing that our forces are split. The there are three bad guys left, three health bars above, and two of them are working down. Uh, I would kind of prefer it if uh, we were all focused on the same guy, and possibly we are now. Possibly we're all focused on this guy. Uh, does he have a net? His name's Shieldbreaker. Well, that seems like a great guy to try and take down. A fighter of mine has been destroyed. I'm, I'm fine with that. As, as things go, I think fighter destruction is kind of more than a little bit acceptable. This is going really well, guys. This is going really well. I was, I was a little bit worried, if I was to be honest with you. I was super worried. But uh, we're doing well. I'm halfway through my shields. The other two vessels seem to be looking okay. Where is the grandest entrance? Almost certainly blown up. A little bit worried about shooting the craft. Let's try and keep it high. Fighters are dropping left and right. No big problem, though. Fighters do get uh, repaired as we are going through life. That's cool. Okay, so that's two down. Press R again. Uh, I'm just going to break away from this whole gaggle of stuff going on here and then turn around. They're the greatest that... Dude, what are you doing? F. 
orders, attack enemies. Dude, you're supposed to be uh, helping. Like, the, the craft is very definitely taking damage. Why isn't the grandest entrance going in? He was supposed to be escorting the, gu the, the, the craft. Didn't work out too well for us. That's unfortunate, but the, wow, this guy's doing well. Who, who are you? You are Hole Breaker. Guide, we've still all got our shields left. Uh, yeah, all of us. All of us, in fact. This is this is going quite well. This is, this is going incredibly well. I feel like we may may have done some um, some bosses out of order here. Maybe, maybe. Is this guy actually going to drop at any point? Fighters are dropping. Uh, but well, where's his shield? Where's his shield? I'm, I'm a little disappointed about the number of fighters that are dropping. This is uh, a shame. But as I say, we will be rebuilding them as we go on. I tend to leave the computer running for a little bit, like just just patrolling sectors while whilst my mining ship is going around. So it gives time for things like my fighters to get rebuilt. Is this guy? Is this guy nearly down? I think this guy is actually really nearly down. Trying to make sure I hit the pieces of hull, pieces of equipment, rather than actually just like going through this gap over here, which you know it could happen quite often. Okay, that's that, that's third down. Let's let's go do it. Let's go do it. Double railgun being picked up. Excuse me, excuse me, Mr. Craft. I just kind of need to squeeze through here. Thank you very much. Okay, back to the attacks. Oh mate, oh mate, this is this is going just too well. This is going just far too well. Okay, we're just going to sit here and pile on a whole load of damage here. I'm, I'm kind of expecting that when we beat up these guys, some sort of weird, uh, like, agglomeration of the two, of the four guys. That was that it. Is that really it? Look, we got we got the purple thing. I was I was expecting one last fight where all four of them can join together into an uber boss. But no, but no. Mission accomplished, the Brotherhood! Yeah, yeah, okay, that's cool. What does, it, what does this artifact do? That's important. What does this artifact do? Oh, it's the one that does everything! Oh, this is great! This is great! Look at it! It, it generates energy, it rech your recharge rate goes down, arm turrets, unarmed turrets, armed or unarmed turrets, shield durability, jump rate, recharge energy, cargo hold, velocity increase, loot collection range, deep scan range, and radar range. Oh, it's everything. It's tasty. That's what it is. It's tasty. And a couple of last things before we finish. We've got ourselves a new bit of mail up here. Hey, Declaration of War. This is Declaration of War. The sender of this declaration and Twitchy are now officially at war. Shouldn't I have something to do with that? Okay. Due to recent events that cannot be tolerated, this sender is forced to defend their territory against threats like this. Yeah, whatever, guys. Whatever. The next thing I need to do, though, is look at the top of my screen. Your arm mining fighters can't pick up ores or scrap. You need a functioning transporter. Okay, let's do that. First thing we need is some blocks. You can see that I've put down some extra generators on the side here, that's because I was really running out of power, and if I'm going to be putting down some teleporters, well then I might even run out of more power, so let's see what's going on with that. Let's go with the Xanon. I, I don't even know where they are. Transport. Tra transporter blocks right here. Okay, cool. I, are we going to go in the corner here? I think we might go in the corner here. Let's uh, let's go with this. One. No, no, no. That, that, that control right there. Uh, and... Point three, yeah, that, that, let's do that. And then along with that, I, I've kind of taken a gamble here. Do I even have a transport upgrade? Transport software. Yeah, 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 I have got it. Look at that. You can only install this upgrade permanently. I would we'll do that then. All right, cool, brilliant. So now they should stop complaining. I'm going to jump out. I don't have permission. I'm going to jump out of this craft. Oh, look, 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 there goes one away. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I just realized I've only got the one miner. Uh, this will destroy it, turn it to blueprint. Okay, 27 minutes per one. Oh, shall we, um, shall we boost some stats quick? Assembly. I wonder how many we can put down. Look, we're generating 28 gigawatts and we're only using nine. I bet, I bet we can, uh, bulk that up a little bit. I'm not, I'm not even gonna try and be sexy about it. We're just gonna straight, like, pump some down here, pump some on the back here. Will this one not go here? Is it like, no, no. No, 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 that's not where that goes. Yeah, it re really doesn't want it. Really doesn't want it. All right, well, I'll get rid of that as well then. Okay, horrific mass of added stuff. Let's see what this has put the time to. Seven minutes. All right, I'll see you guys in, oh, I don't know, 20. Alternative black can completely hijack the system by applying huge, great big slabs of stuff on the back here. These are all assemblies, but look, oh, we are having troubles up top. Doesn't really matter though, because we just, we just want to get these made. But with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure ladies and gentlemen i will see you guys next time where well, we're gonna go try and carry on chasing down the remaining zotan artifacts today we took on the four not expecting to have a boss fight today but it totally happened and we also managed to get ourselves some mining fighters so i'll see you then when we're gonna do that bye